Welcome to the Urban Survival Course. My name's Rich Hungerford and I'm going to be your instructor for the course. My background is diverse, but predominantly from a Special Forces military background. So a lot of the information we're going to put across into the course material for you has been trialled and utilised by myself and the people I work with or used to work with over many years when we're operating in an urban environment. A lot of that has been in a situation of duress, collapse, societal sort of breakdown and the absence or the removal of law and order as a norm, which makes this information important because it's actually how things happen. We've broken up the course into a number of different sections. So each section we're going to go through, we're going to talk about the key life support requirements for a human being in the urban setting when the supply chain is disrupted. So this course is unique in that aspect. We're going to look at root cause analysis type approach to dealing with the issue of urban survival. We're looking at what you need to keep yourself, your loved ones, your immediate family, extended family and community of friends and associates alive when the supply chain is compromised. Cause of compromise is not such a big effort or focus for this course because it's the disruption to the supply chain, the things that brings you food, water, utilities and fuel and all those other things that make your life what it is today being disrupted by some event, whether it's man-made or a natural disaster event, that is the key question. What happens when the supply is turned off? What do I need to do about it? What is a priority? How do I keep myself emotionally centered? And how do I then find or have prepared beforehand some level of life support requirement that will allow me to prevail until something else comes to mind. And that is the essence of this course. So thank you for joining the course. I'm hoping that we'll pass on a lot of useful information to you. If you're experienced in this space, hope it will fill the gaps and build you or help you to build a congruent system approach to urban survival. If you're brand new, it should be at least at the level that allow you to start to put things together so that when things do happen, you are ready and your family is safe. And that's what we're really fundamentally all about, keeping ourselves and our families safe in the changing and challenging times that we face as a species going forward.